I don't regret anything. You mm -hmm. know, I, I don't live in that place of regret because we learn from our lessons that happen, hard times, good times. We learn and take the lesson and move forward and you progress in life. No, no, no. There's things I regret not saying. Oh, the one-liners that I've come up with after the show's already been on the air, those are killer. Because those are like, damn, I should have said it. But no, I, I, I don't regret anything I've said. I mean, I guess in hindsight, I regret saying the Denise stuff. Mm -hmm. um, but it had already been said. So it, you know, it, it kind of ties me up. I, I don't think I would have preferred to blindside her either. And also, I have to apologize publicly to Shane Simpson. I'm just going to do this right now because I feel so bad that I was so mean and I thought it was funny and I thought Emily I was like oh we're doing it's going to be funny we're making fun of Shane for this mm -hmm. and it and it, it I felt bad I felt like it wasn't funny to make fun of him and I actually am very proud of Shane Simpson he's a brilliant man he's a wonderful father he's a very good partner to one of my very dearest friends and I love him so that I'm gonna say that Shane Simpson rocks socks. He really does. Was Emily not happy about the the lowering the bar comment? No, she was okay. fine with it. Okay. <laughs> but, but it was. But I, I, you know, it's like it's one of those things. You're like, oh, this is funny, right? This is so right. hysterical. But then you don't realize like you put things out there and like it's actually something's actually like it. It just you don't always have the goal for the joke. And in that circumstance, I think I should have mm, pushed up my friend like she's mm. like my friend you know and I and I regret that so that's a, one that is a regret oh my god I don't think you have enough time <laughs> watching it back so many regrets but you know I I really try to take them all as a learning lesson mm -hmm. um not just for like the not just the show but just in life you know you get to see yourself um which most people don't get that experience so yeah I think I there's a lot of regrets <laughs> yeah one that like really pops into your mind yeah i just wish i had um this thought and you know we could have it could have been handled differently mm -hmm. and um we could have gotten to a much better place quickly mm -hmm. more quickly so um i just wish that i was more open to that and yeah and she knows yeah. that one moment that you wish never aired oh maybe my pale white ass when bill was carrying me out maybe that should have got a spray tan you know, I don't really have any regrets. Um, you know, I, I'm not that person. I mean, look, there's a lot of things that happened to me that I would not have rather shared, but it's my life. And, you know, I say that Bravo has the privilege to follow me, you know, uh, they get to follow my life. I, you know, I'm not on the show and it's my life. You know, I have a life and so, it is what it is. I don't regret anything. You know, I, I don't live in that place of regret because we learn from our lessons that happen, hard times, good times. We learn and take the lesson and move forward and you progress in life. So, um, you know, who knows if those relationships would still be intact? You, you don't know because even with families that are not on TV, you know, you go through those ebbs and flows, you know, and things happen. And so if you are able to communicate and if you're able to, um, you know, come back together after you know, a disagreement or what have you, then you move forward and you continue those relationships. If you're not, then you don't. So it's really hard to say, but I, I um, take the lessons mm -hmm. and I progress into the future. And um, I hope that everybody's doing well. You know, you only wish the best for people, but mm -hmm. as you grow, you know, sometimes you grow away from certain relationships mm -hmm. and that's true with friendships, family and, you know, businesses. So, um, yeah, I don't really live in a place of regret.